Hi everyone, my name is Christian Reed and today I'm at Acme Tools to talk about the M1 Caliper Measuring Tool. The M1 Caliper clamps onto miter saw fences and displays a measurement of any material rolled underneath it. The M1 is very simple to get set up with the clamp in the back that will clamp to any flat surface less than 3 eighths of an inch with a simple squeeze here. The clamp is in the lock position. The arm drops down and automatically adjusts to different height materials allowing for you to start with your material on the left side, slide it under, and you'll see the measurement on the screen changes as I slide a material to my location. So starting off a cut, I move it over, touch the right side of my saw blade, hit the zero button, and you'll notice that it accounts for the saw blade width automatically on it, slide it to my desired location, make my cut, and then I'm able to start the next cut without stopping to take off the piece of material to scribe my line again on it, allowing for very fast repeat cuts without having to set up a hard stop or any other system to make consistent cuts. So getting started with the M1 is very simple. So I first find a nice position that's not touching any ribs on the back of it, squeeze down the clamp until I hear the click, let go, and now the M1 is secured to the saw fence. We'll drop the arm down, and then every time we start off a cut, we want to touch off on the saw blade. So we'll slide it over here, make sure we're lightly touching off on the edge of the saw blade carbide tips, or alternatively, we could start with a cut. Then we'll go over back to the M1, hit the zero button, and you'll notice the negative value will be displayed along with the blade width, which in this case is 3 seconds of an inch. And then from there, slide it over, make sure everything is zeroed, slide it to our desired cut location, and now whatever measurement is displayed on the screen is what the piece on the right side will be once we complete our cut here. And one of the nice things about the M1 is once my first cut is made, I don't need to remove the piece of molding. I can just hit the zero button, keep sliding over, and make my second cut streamlined without stopping in between. Thanks for checking out the M1 Caliper, available now at Acme Tools and acmetools.com.